Hello everybody, welcome back to Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. I'm your host Nintenkid91 here, and today we are going to be doing the Tenpo Challenge. So, it just happens to uh, be that we're starting off by one of them right now, um, but I'm actually going to do them in a specific order that I kind of know them in. Uh, and the way we do that is we're going to start over by the castle gate, and then kind of work our way from the right side of the map around, so counterclockwise. And uh, that's just the way I walkthroughs do it, and that's kind of the way I'm most familiar with. So the first one is going to be from this sign out, and what you just got to do is you got to shoot them, but they're really hard to get because the sensitivity on this game is ridiculous. And the other hard part is you're also moving, and it's really... Yeah, for some reason, this game actually... They're not that accurate, but, like, they really require you to lead a shot when you're moving. Plus, I mean, you gotta think that you're moving along with the Poe itself, so it's a real pain in the ass to do. And you catch them in bottles. So we have to go back and forth every three, which kind of sucks because then we're just gonna have to get one and return it. But I guess right now we could go get one, or return this one, so... Next, no, you know what, let's just go on to the second one. We'll do three, and three, 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 one, I guess, I don't know. Because the last one's actually pretty close to this area that we started. So the second one's here. This one's a bitch. They're all bitch, actually, because you got to shoot them right away or else it's just too difficult because they'll get way ahead of you because they're actually traveling faster than you are, so. Oh, we defeated another pawn. Do you want to catch it in a bottle? Yes, I do. You caught a big ball. Sell it for more. Alrighty, Pona, let's go on. So our next one is going to be in this area. And it's really weird, because I think you have to go through a bush to trigger it. But the nice thing is we're doing this after the arrow upgrade, so we can hold 40. And uh, sometimes I just spam the shit out of my arrows, <laughs> like rapid fire. Alright, which bush? I think you go through here. Yep, there we go. Shit. There we go. Right in the eye. Alright, so that's three. Now, what I think I'm going to do is I'll show this first time returning them, and then from that point on, I'm just going to collect them and just have the portions of us collecting them, and then I'll go back when we return the last one for the gift. Because you guys don't want to see me go back and forth between returning them, and then he says the same thing every time, except that you'll see what changes the number. He gives you points on a card per Poe, so that's the only thing that changes. But nothing else changes in the text, and nothing special happens until you obviously get the last one, so that's why I think I'm just going to show their locations and then show the final returning of the last Poe. Alright, so let's bring out all our Poes here and set them to our C buttons. Talk to this dude. Hey, young man, what's happening today? If you have a poem, I will buy it. Your card now has zero points. Come back again. <laughs> okay, so there's our first one. Oh, you brought a poem today. Hmm, very interesting. This is a big poem. I'll buy it for 50 rupees. On top of that, I'll put 100 points on your card. If you earn 1,000 points, you'll be a happy man. <laughs> Alright, so that's what happens. Each Poe you return, you get 100 points, and then you also get 50 rupees. So I'm going to go ahead and return these last two, and then I'll meet you guys back outside at Hyrule Field. Alright guys, so we're back. We returned all the Poe's. We got 181 rupees from it, and uh, yeah, we're three down, seven to go. So let's get on with number four, five, and six. So the fourth one is actually kind of towards Garadu Valley, and... Uh, there's two ways, I don't know, you can go at it from either direction. I think it's easier going the opposite direction than we're going right now, though, but we'll see if we trigger him. So, he should be... Uh, you know what, I'm going to loop around. Yeah, he actually spawns from near this tree over here, so... I'm going to loop back here. Stop your Pona. Alright, let's see. You gotta go from the right side of the tree. And there we go, he should be up. There he is. Oh shit, this one's going sideways. I'm gonna bail out on that one. Alright, Epona. Whoa, don't buck me off now. I just, I'm trying to be your friend. Alright, this looks more reasonable. What? 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 Oh, I'm wasting arrows. Okay, that was stupid. 
huge arrow waste. I should have had that earlier. Damn it! Now I'm gonna have to go buy arrows. Alright, there we go. Alright, one, two. Nice. Just what I wanted. So if we can get them in two shots, we'll have enough to get the last three of them, and then we'll be able to return and go buy some more. And I don't have to do that on screen, because you guys know where to buy arrows in the store. You, get, you actually have to get them in Kakariko now, though, since the market is obviously a shithole. <laughs> because of Ganon. What an asshole. Why did I just get off Epona? What? Can I get on Epona? There we go. Okay, now we got it. Alright, so the next one appears, like, over here. Um, kind of got to go along here. And then she appears, like, it, there it is. It's in the wall, though, so it ran away. It f disappeared. I mean, whatever. Here we go. Where you at, Poe? I can't shoot this arrow. Oh, I did shoot it. Dang it. That stunk. I can't get this one to go. Whoa, Epona, you're riding in the walls here. You got a little goofiness in your head. Are you drunk or something? Seriously. Stop running. Stop running. I'm going too fast. I can't handle it. Alright, let's try this again. Where, what? Why? <laughs> Poe? Dude. I'm gonna have to cut this out. Man, this is bullshit. I can't find this little bastard. Alright, come on. There we go. No. 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 Oh, we ran out! Son of a bitch! Oh my god. Alright, I'm gonna go return this one, and then I'm gonna get some arrows and meet you guys back here. So, see you in a minute. In a second, actually. Oh, look who it is. It's the loser guy. Duh! It'd be really awkward if I put Link's crotch right in front of his face. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Jesus. Look at this guy's chest hair. Not to mention his eyes. Alright guys, I'm back. I got full arrows and we're ready to do this. I emptied that Poe, so we got three bottles. Let's do this right now. We're ready. I'm ready to freaking bring hell to this Poe. Nice. Dude, don't be freaking- Why did you curve to the right? Or left, I mean. Jeez. You were, like, going on a straight path for that area. Alright. Loop around. The opponent would turn in a radius that wasn't, like, 90 feet. <laughs> Alright, here we go. I'm ready. Where you at, buddy? You didn't appear. I'm disappointed. I don't know what to tell you guys right now. This is ridiculous. I'm doing it the right way because you're supposed to ink. What the hails? How'd you get there, buddy? I'm really starting to get impatient here. And it's pissing me off. Backing it up, backing up my trunk. Alright. Here we go. No. Stop, dude! Come on! Why you always gotta go that way? What the hell? Chill out, Epona. Chill out. I know they're ghosts. They won't hurt you. I promise. No, not gonna form. Oh, here we go. Here we go. This is the money shot. There we go. Do it from the other direction, finally. Jeez. Only took you, like, 30 tries. Man, you're... I'm just horrible at this. Do I want to... Yeah, I better catch it. I ain't letting that thing return to life. Or the world. Alright, so now that we got that one, now we have to go all the way past the Lake Hylia entrance. And take down two of them, actually. There's, like, two really confined in this area. It's really annoying knowing which one you actually got, though. Because they almost spawn from the exact same area. But there are two things that you can kind of identify which Poe you'll be spawning. So, we're going to go ahead and do... I don't know. <laughs> I guess it would be considered the six. But there's one that spawns from this boulder here. Let me, let me show you guys what I'm talking about. Back up. Back up. Gotta go over here a little bit. Alright. Now we pwn a chill. Turn. And let's see. I think this is right. 
think we go here. There we go. Except we're moving away. Oh, nice shot. Oh my gosh. That was a, a sweet shot. I'm lucky that I got that one. Because he was starting to curve to my right. I can't do that that stuff. I'm not that good. You defeated the Poe the Ghost. Do you want to catch it in a bottle? Yeah, I better. I bet people in my hallway right now think I'm like crazy. Because they can easily hear me if they're in the hallway. If not, whatever. Alright, so the way to get to this other one. Oh, perfect. Run through these bushes right here and he should form. There he is. Easy squeezy. Stop crying. Don't don't mess up now. Ooh, nice snipe. I was going to say, if I miss him after that, I'm going to be disappointed in myself. Alright, so that's another three. So now we got to actually return him. You have the fate of the pole. Catch me in a bottle? Of course. Alright, so I'm going to go return these bad boys. Like last time. You guys know the drill by now. Be right back. Play the best song in the world. Or I'll eat your soul. So and we played the first thing that came to our heads. Just so happened to be. The, what, the, the, okay. Alright, guys. So we're back just a little bit away from where we were last time. We're south, southeast ish. And we're near those two paths that converge. So the next one spawned from this rock here off the path. So let's line ourselves up and get on with it. Alright, so we should get it after this, right here. There it is. One. Oh, right before it went into the wall. I had to hold my breath there. I was like a sniper, actually holding their breath for the shot. Oh, this stuff frustrates me, man. It's ridiculous. You defeated Paul the Ghost. Do you want to keep it? Catch it? Yeah, I do. Alright, so that's... Eight. So, yeah, we just gotta get nine and ten. And 9 is actually right along this wall, but I'm going to get it the other way. I'm going to get it from, you, if you go the other direction than what I just did, it'll appear. Chill out, Link. Chill out. You're okay. Alright. Or er, Moripona, I guess, is the one that needs to chill out. She's crazy. She eats people. Alright, here we go. Where are you? What the hell, man? What? Are you going to stop? Okay, well now i got to waste the arrow. I hate when I do that. There we go. Oh, get back here. Shit, 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 shit. Oh. 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 Damn, I thought I could have had it, and I'm going to need... Oh, man, if I can get this one in two shots, I can waste the last freaking couple of arrows on the hardest one. And this one's ridiculous, because I don't want to reload. Although, at, le at least I can reload, because it's by Kakariko, so it won't take much time. But I don't want to. I want to get it. Well, actually, maybe we can... Whoa, easy there, Epona. I was going to say, maybe we can get some from these bushes real quick. I think we should be able to run through them. Yes, we did. We got, like, five or something. Yeah, we did get five. The math works. Alright, where you at? Oh, why did I bring another one? Where you at? Oh, thank God you come from the lantern. I was going to say, if that pole was going to form up there, I'm going to be mad. You defeat... Uh, for some reason, I thought I just said you defecated the pole. Like, I didn't shit on it. <laughs> Alright, now for the final one. The most annoying pole of them all. This one's a real pain in the butt because it's right along this river going in the Sora's domain and stuff. And it likes to fly across. But there's two ways you can trigger it. One of the ways is from up here. And then you just kind of got to shoot at it really quick. And that's really hard. Like that. Which I just wasted a good arrow on. But the other way is if you go below. Even though we have to go all the way around. So let's go. Thank God we have a horse that travels faster than my two feet. Although it's one horsepower. It still does the job. You have to go under this thing. It might form right here and go that way if we come in a little quick. But the way I got it earlier was like I lined myself up here, kind of along the shore or the riverbed area, and then I went through here, brought it out, 
and tried to shoot him. Ugh, shit, I got three left. That ain't good. But that's the way you gotta do it, and it's tough. Let me tell you that. It is tough. I suck at aiming on this game. It's like the sensitivity's high, like crazier than the sensitivity on Call of... The hell? I'm gonna say, what the balls is going on? What? How do you miss that? Of course. How did I miss that first shot? I don't even know. Alrighty, Pona. Get off. Get out of here. I'm going to get some arrows. I'll be right back. Oh, yeah. Sniff my ass. Sniff my ass. How does it smell? Navi, no, this is... Oh, yeah. Sniff that ass, dude. Just keep ramming your face into it. Oh, now ram it into my crotch. Yeah, you like that? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. I already did this, but it's still funny. <laughs> He's like, I want more. I want more. Give me more. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> what the hell, freaking rock thing? Oh, you bastard! You stupid bastard Poe! No, don't go up the stairs, you Pona. That's a bad thing. Man, this one's a pain in the ass! Oh my gosh. Alright. No, stop. Why, why you gotta run? Why are you running into the wall? You can't go in there. Do you want a drink? Is that what you want? Jeez. Alright, what the hell? Your butt's in my way. I can't see. Dude, how is that first shot going... Okay, good luck. I can't even see. How is that first shot not hitting him, though? I don't get that. That first shot definitely nailed him right in the freaking head. Right in the head. Alright, take 300. Here we go. 9 million rupees later, probably, in arrows. Spent. Alright, one... Two, yes! Thank you! With the long shot. Oh my gosh, that pissed me off. Okay, here we go. Link, you're gonna get wet, I don't care. I want this and I'm running in to return it right now. Yes, I defeated the bow! Yay! I'm so happy! Finally, we're done! That is so tough. I hate doing the Poe thing. Any playthrough I do, that's my least favorite. Like archery part because it's so hard oh so many arrows required just to get that done all right let's get these things returned and get a reward which is well earned and deserved i hope it's something good maybe it'll be like a new item like a freaking beast item maybe it'll be one of those spears on the wall and it'll be a new weapon or something Hey, you brought the pit. Oh, wait. Yeah, we already know. Blah. Yes. See, he says the same thing every time. You guys didn't have to sit through all this crap, but I did. Like, our, my recording right now is 30 minutes. From the start of this Poe stuff till now, 30 minutes. Just because of all this hocus pocus crap and having to go buy more arrows. Very interesting. This is a big Poe. Yes, it is. Ow. My leg just cracked. That hurt. Okay. If you earn a thousand points, I'll be a happy man. Yes, I will. Oh, here we go. Here's my a thousandth point Poe. Oh, you brought a Poe today. Hmm. Very interesting. This is a big Poe. I'll buy it for 50 rubies. On top of that, I'll put a hundred points on your card. If you earn a thousand points, you'll be a happy man. <laughs> Wait a minute. Wow, you have earned a thousand points. Young man, you are a genuine ghost hunter. Is that what you expected me to say? He he he. Because of you, I have extra inventory of big poes, so this will be the last time I can buy a ghost. You are thinking about what I promised would happen when you earned a thousand points. He he. Don't worry, I didn't forget. Just take this. A freaking bottle? Oh my gosh. Well, whatever. Now we got all the bottles, so I guess it's not that bad. And not just any bottle, an empty bottle, huh? Could have at least put something in it, you know? Alright, so let's get back to our normal setup. Alright, so... I'm gonna go ahead and end this since it's like 30 minutes long and gonna be a pain in the butt to edit. And I'll see you guys next time. And I don't know what we're gonna do, but it sure as hell ain't gonna involve shooting arrows at pose. So, see you then.